I'm Nino Tosong. Today I want to show you our cat puzzles. The cat puzzles is Nina Ottoson by Cat Status and Pet Status. We have three different levels from level one to level three. I will show you, but first I will put down this little cutie. We have one in level one, the hunt and swat, tree tumble, there you can put treats on the back side and you can also adjust the size where the treats will fall out and when the cat is wobbling with this is a weight in the bottom so it will wobbling back and forth when the, when the cat is playing with it then we have three puzzles in level two we have the bugging out which is perfect to add wet food in the base compartment and you can also in this i will show you wet food in the base compartments can you put but you will also put treats inside the sliding cups so that your cat has to push this away until the treats fall out in the base compartments this one is easy for the cat to slide and then the treats fall out in the base compartment I hope you can see the treats, yes. And you can make it a little more difficult by putting treats inside the sliding cup and then cover the leaves so the cat have to push this away before they can slide the cup and the treats fall out in the basic compartment. And then we also have The Melon Madness, and that is the same. You can put wet food in the compartments if you want to, but here you also put treats in the sliding cups and cover with the leaf. And then the cat has to swivel this away and then push the block or peg up. And then the treats fall out in the compartments. On this side, it's more easy. Here they put treats inside the sliding block or peg. And then the cat have to swivel this away and the peg fell down. And the cat has to push it up to get the treats who is falling out in the compartments. And this one is two-sided, which is perfect if you have two cats. They can work from other sides. And it's a fun way to feed your cat. And then we have the kitty licky layers. It is a puzzle and feeder in one. There is three layers. The cat can spin around to find treats or food you put inside. And you can easily take this apart by pushing together underneath and you can take these apart all three layers can be taken apart then so it's easy to fill it with food wet food dry food or treats but also easier when you want to clean it in the dishwasher machine and it's easy to put them together again you just put them together like this and then you have a puzzle again and this one is perfect to use with wet food. You put wet food in all compartments. And you can also put dry food in all compartments in the puzzle. So it's easy to have treats, dry food, or wet food, or only wet food. So this one is a feeding bowl and also a puzzle. So puzzle and feeder in one. It's a great way to feed your cat daily and let your cat work to find the food. And then we also have a level three puzzle. 
this is the rainy day and here's the same you can add wet food in compartments but you also put treats inside the Schleinen cups and then you cover and then the cat have to spin this away and then push the pegs aside so the treats fell out in the compartments and also in the spinning wheel you put treats under the spinning wheel so your cat has to spin this around and this is a fun way also to let your cat work for treats and food the rainy day is a level three puzzle and puzzles is great for cats but cats is smarter than we think and cats are hunter so i recommend to hide puzzles in different rooms and let the cat find the puzzles let the cat hunt for the puzzles and just so you know cats not always play when we want them to play cats decide by themselves when they want to play with the puzzles so it's a great way to put puzzles in different rooms and let the cat play when they want to play i hope you will enjoy the puzzles and remember, cats are smarter than we think. And cats who loves to eat, it's a perfect way to let the cats work for the food. Enjoy! Bye bye!